instant cash. Buy, sell, trade. Call us at 310-555-0112. Actually, we're just outside of that warehouse, and um, we're going to go see if we can track down Muddy here. Uh, we have a Lucky Star hotel key, and if I am correct, the Lucky Star is one of the other hotel. Whoa, wait a minute. There's a hotel sign right there. But um, let's see. Lucky Star. Lucky Star. I don't know where the Lucky Star is. It doesn't seem to be one. Lucky Star. Where is that? Uh, Milton. Derby was nowhere to be found. Lucky Star Motel. Where is the Lucky Star Motel? Um, talk to a bomb. Yeah. Killing about revenge. I guess we have to go see Grout, because I can't really find the Lucky Star Motel. I don't know where it is. Um, I mean, unless this is it. It doesn't seem that way. Hollow Brook Hotel. That's different and not active. Where the hell is the Lucky Star? Is it in Santa Monica? I mean, I could head down there and take a quick peek around. I really don't think it is, because that place is very densely packed. And I don't think there's anything else. So it must be, um, like before, it's uh, that quest resolves ahead of what we can do here. So we'll just have to keep wandering around. Um, we're supposed to go to Grout's Mansion, I guess. I don't really want to, but I guess that's what there is to do. So, um, actually, let's spend some experience points, and then, um, see what we can do. I want to be, let's see, Charm, Haggle Feet. I don't care about the Haggle Feet. Uh, ooh, ooh. There, that increases my, what in the hell? Oh, I didn't mean to put that there. What is going on? Cancel. Oh, 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 oh. It's from my it's from my charm that I picked up earlier. Okay. So there's that. My computer is, is at five. Um scholarship is getting there. Alright, let's do it. I think that's good. I mean, if I were a smart man, I would just start investing in combat skills, but I am not a smart man, so fuck it. Um, did I just pass the taxi? I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Alright, um, do I want to go get more blood? Not really. Let's just go back to the, um, the taxi and take it to the next area. Um, I'm not particularly interested in going back and talking to Heather. She kind of weirds me out, but I guess do the best we can here. Need a ride? Yes, I do. Crowd's Mansion. Eventually, we get this, this like, story gets kind of global, and we go, like, to China and all kinds of crazy stuff. Nines, what are you doing here? Badly rendered leaf, what are you doing you, here? What are you doing here? Um, I was... No. No. Okay. Um, I'm looking, are you looking into to, to, to Trout's disappearance? You should get out of here. This place is bad news. Uh, pardon me. Um, what's inside? Nines, what's inside? Badass Anarch is like, nope. Dude, I saw Nines at the scene, and that's not good. Maybe he killed the dude. Oh, uh, whatever. Let's go. Let's go. This is gonna... I'm gonna regret this so much. I'm not emotionally prepared for this. Oh, my gosh. Alright. Hey, what's up? Oh. Oh, okay. Is that what we're doing? Alright, hold on. No, 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 Hold on. Come here. That was uncomfortable. I guess this is a combat area. Um. Yeah, let's heal up a little bit, and then let's get ready. We're gonna... There was no real way to avoid that. I mean, I guess you can not set them off, so I'm going to try to be more stealthy, but um, this looks bad. This looks real bad. Just chill out. Oh, stay the fuck away from me. Stay the fuck away from me. Oh, man. Yep, this is definitely my... Not my milieu. Oh, 
what's up? Alright, so that was terrifying. It is quite peculiar, the happenings I've been made to witness for my supernatural longevity. I am thinking of one unfortunate phenomenon in particular of unique interest to my station, both as a professional and as a sufferer of this vampiric condition. It seems the stream of time has begun to erode the moorings of my chosen course of study, for the methodologies that gave birth to psychology are slowly disappearing. I find myself in an era that overlooks the physical component of psychological pathology. I am again in favor of the sophistic practices of Freud. Phrenology, dactopindalism, and the rest of the guard have fallen by the wayside. Its champions all silenced in death, with my unique exception. Would that I could make my voice heard again, although it may be suspicious should I return to popular medical discourse 50 years after my apparent death. <sighs> no, better that I continue my studies into the psychoses in secret. One day. May I hold up my own cure as validation of the methods. I am huh. confident no cure for my condition or that of my beloved wife lies within our figurative minds waiting to be unlocked by the correct combination of memories recovered from our childhoods. And I'm most certain it has nothing to do with the relationship between myself, my parents, and my genitals. Sorry, Sigmund, but I choose to say <laughs> my thoughts. In time, too, may your star Okay, so that was something. Perception of the ship. Harmony is made. Well, that's super great that he just left it there. Oh, we got another one. All right, here we go. Another unfortunate casualty to tide of time. Insane asylums. I lament their loss not only as brokerage houses for the breadth and depth of human psychosis, but also I shall mourn the disappearance of that peculiar environment present only in an insane asylum. That palpable atmosphere of blistered brains and churning bowels, the odiferous melange of freely growing bodily humors, that gently rolling cacophony of distant sobs and screams, the muttered cursing of perceived enemies, and the blissful gurgling of the lobotomized, like a newborn babe discovering the sky. Mm. Eh, I shall still find test subjects as surely as I find bloody sustenance in the night, but this climate, I fear, may never be replicated. Oh, I'm an idiot. Perception shapes the mind and rules over time. So perception does time. Okay, I'll write all this down and we'll actually do this instead of just randomly pressing buttons like I was while he was talking. All right, let's see here. Um, perception moves time and mind. Time erodes human perception, so it's going to be... Uh, Perception time by itself with how many progress is made. Okay, whatever. All right, so we got this. So this one controls that one. See? Wait a minute. Oh, it's switching them back and forth now. God damn it. Okay. There we go. No problems. Just took me a second there. I had to sort of figure out my shit, and it was kind of frustrating. But otherwise, we're good. Okay, so now I think that's over here. Yeah. under this shit. Um, yeah, right, there we go. This is open now. Cool. Hey, dude, what's up? Whoa. All right, you come here. Come on. Oh, man. Funny me with your, your slashy gimp names. This might be the death of me. This is pretty fucking scary. I am such a poor combatant. Oh man, nope, I'm, I'm turning the tide, I'm turning the tide. Oh, can I feed on you? Nope. Nope. Alright, 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 whatever. I'll stop trying. I was just hoping I could get some blood back, but... That stairway goes to nowhere. Um, 
Okay, so... I definitely should have stopped by Heather's before I came here. This is something else. What is this? What? Where is that? Some room I haven't been in yet, I guess. Okay, um... Locked? Locked. Not... Oh, locked. Okay, so... Great. Thank... Good talk. Oh, it opens... Okay, it wasn't a stairway to nowhere. It was a stairway to somewhere. Do you ever get the feeling with this game that they have to just put in some obligatory combat scenes every once in a while? Like, that, that, that so many of the quests can be solved without violence, and that eventually they have to just make you... They have to make you fight. No big deal. All right, um... Often I reflect with great regret on the missed opportunity that was my infector. Had I been conscious after the attack, I could have stopped the orderlies from locking her in the roaming pen. What I would give for just one interview, a few simple questions of the plague-ridden woman who met her end that dawn. And of course, there is no guarantee she would have been any more helpful than my current crop of test subjects, mewling wretches. Few could be called enthusiastic. Given the nature of the tests, I cannot expect the same fervor from all, but a modicum of cooperation would be appreciated. Animals. The one called John went so far as to gnaw off his arm and escape into the floorboards like some feral rodent. I still hear him scurrying about at night. He must be making an atrocious mess in there. Wow. This guy gives no shits at all. And apparently, so he was he was in an asylum, and he was bitten by someone else. My studies proceed at a languid pace. I'm mired in a foul ennui as my wife's illness advances. My subjects grow restless without proper supervision, but I cannot pull myself back from this black depression. How many nights I've wasted now, gazing from the tower walk, pondering the frailty hmm. of existence. That's where I am now. The tower walk. I apologize for the sound effects. Oh god. Alright, so we're gonna fight. Wait, can I sneak up on her? Can I sneak up on these people? Oh! Okay. Okay. I guess that happened. Um, I guess this is a good spot to end this video. Um, I am going to continue soon, but it seems that we uh, ran through our time really quick together this time. So um, I'm going to pause here, and we'll continue running through Spooky Manor next time.